Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to fix gaps on your rings in two easy steps. Um, so the gaps are normally caused by the distortion of the rings um, and some common causes could be that um, using the rings, opening it incorrectly, um, pulling on the wrong parts or using too much force. Now the right way to open your rings is actually by pulling onto either of the middle two rings like this or of course by pushing down the two tabs on the two ends. Okay, so now I've got two gaps on this um, ring. The first one is on this ring over here. I'm just gonna do a close-up shot. You can see that there's a big gap in here. So first we wanted to check if two sides of the rings are aligned this way. Um, for example, this gap here is obviously created by um, the two rings not aligned. So it's kind of like this right now and that's why it's not closing perfectly. Um, to fix this, we're going to open the rings first and I'm going to apply force in the opposite direction. So I want this side to go this way and this side to go that way. So I'm just going to push gently. You don't have to use too much force, just gently. Okay, and then close it and just check. See, that's already much better. It's pretty much already disappeared. But if it doesn't on your ring, you can just reopen it and then repeat the steps before a couple of times and eventually it will be closed perfectly. After step one, if there's still a gap, it usually means that the gap is pulled. This It's gap this way. So it's a line, but it's just pulled wide apart. Um, that's normally caused by pulling the rings too hard or just after long-term use. So you can see that this ring, these two sides are aligned, but there's still a gap in between. To fix this, we're also going to open the rings. Uh, now the key is that you want to hold on to this set of ring when you're pushing this one inward um, so that the rings doesn't close on you. So I'm just going to push this one over here. Okay, and then turn around and hold on to this one and push this one inward like that. So it is getting a little bit better, but there's still a tiny bit of gap on this one and a little bit on this one. So we're just gonna repeat the steps a couple more times until the gap is completely disappeared. I've already fixed all the gaps on this ring. Take a look. So that's it. If you have any questions, please post down below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.